this is courtesy of Art Concert Channel, and it features the Blessed Madonna back to back with High. And I wanted to quickly mention this because I've never seen this before in terms of a stage design and production. And I feel like a lot of these festivals out here will cost an arm and a leg. It's a you know cost a million to fucking camp there and to get there and flights and accommodation. But the actual production of the shows or the festivals aren't that interesting. It's the same shit, just a table, some speakers, and there you go, Bob's your uncle, right? Some of them don't even have fucking screens. I thought this was a really clever way to kind of get around not having screens and just a clever way of maybe creating space and a clever, interesting way to do the set design. So this is at a festival called Nuit Sonnes, which is, I think is Night Summers or something, right? I don't know what, what that means in French, Son, Sonoros, but I know that's night in French, but it's a festival based in Lyon. And this was a back-to-back -back set that was happening between the Blessed Madonna and High, um, UK legend, London legend, stand-up. And I thought this little mirrored effect that they had on stage was really, really clever in terms of creating an ability for the people in the festival to kind of see what they usually were doing behind the decks and also create like an interesting visual people watching it after the fact. So I'm going to play a clip from the DJ back-to-back -back performance now. <laughs> And as you can see from the beat, can you see that? So as you can see here, where DJ, where Bless Madonna and Haya on the crowd, there's like a mirrored thing on top of them, hanging on top, right? And it's sort of like hung at an angle. So essentially you get to see the DJs playing. You get to see them from the top down as you're in the crowd. So it kind of creates like a, like an interesting screen type of thing. So it's not a screen. So it's not maybe as expensive as actually getting a screen. And it probably isn't just a heavy piece of glass because the insurance now would be crazy. It's probably just a, what you call it? It's probably plastic, right? A very reflective type of plastic that they've kind of stressed out, I would assume. And you can, but you get the ability to kind of see at least two angles of the stage, which I feel like creates like a better experience if you're at a festival, especially if you're like far behind and you can't see them performing or whatnot. I quite like that. I think this would actually even work in nightclubs if they wanted to. But in the festival, especially during the day, this is fucking perfect. They play a little bit more of the clip. <laughs> And they've actually got, if you see behind it, they've actually got another screen behind them, actually. There's actually another screen too. Another kind of, I'm, sure, I'm pretty sure it's a plastic material. It's some sort of a plastic film or something along those kind of lines that they've kind of stretched out around the back. So you kind of have it around the back of the stage as well to create a kind of illusion of space. And you also have it hanging above the DJ. I think it's just a pretty cool idea. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll leave it there, I'll leave it there. But yeah, before it gets crazy. High was on a mad one. Um, big up High also. This is another reminder um, and kind of reminded me why some DJs don't like doing back-to-backs. As much as I like Bless Madonna, I think she's a decent DJ. High was on another level. High really showed her up. Like she was on another level. You can, t you could, the, the worst thing about back-to-backs is that you can tell when somebody's doing really badly because you can tell when the per other better person comes on all the time even if you're not paying even if you're not watching the video you can always see oh yeah that's the other person because their track selection is just on point like especially if they're playing just two tracks you're like oh your selection just keeps getting better and better and it's two tracks only but you're just smashing the two tracks again and again and again so i really recommend you check it out um it was a live stream they had to take it down for a bit i don't know i'm not sure why and they had to re-upload it but still um i watched it live when it came out and it was fucking fire so definitely check it out and i think um this festival nuit sonores is definitely one to kind of add to the list especially with it being in Lyon in France which I've never been to and I think in general festivals are a really good excuse um, to kind of go traveling to far-flung places that you probably wouldn't visit if the festival wasn't on there 
and um, this is a really good option to do so and I think these videos these live streams that they do are a really good opportunity to kind of get more people to kind of visit these festivals and check them out and obviously to help the DJs and whatnot but I think ultimately the festivals benefit the most because people look at it and think oh rah this is my kind of vibe the crowd as well from what I could see looked very um, you know the range in terms of ages was interesting you know the last thing you want is to be at a festival where everyone's sort of the same age whether they're old or young a nice kind of range across the board kind of helps everyone kind of looks chill um even though it's packed it still looks like there's space around and stuff everyone's got shirts on so you know it's not super cool cold or super hot so all that stuff kind of adds to it and just a little added benefit of like what they did with the stage design just kind of adding some little bit that probably didn't cost them too much but maybe logistic wise took a bit of work but just little things just to kind of increase the fucking um production and value factor for the audience i'm all for it so big up this festival big up best madonna and back to back with high recommend you check it out if you haven't already um really interesting and for me really cool um set i'll probably link it in the description too if you want to check it out but it's on there courtesy of art concert rt concert art e with the e on the end concert on youtube you can find it on there bless madonna back to back with high